common man? Dana White hates the common man. Calling and have it. Hello. I didn't have the ringer turned on. Okay. What's up? Hello. Yeah. Yeah. Don't call and then just be freaked when I actually fucking answer. Or if I call you back, bitch. Motherfucker. Never do good against this fucking guy. What up? Hey, what's going on? Hey, right, hi. Hey, hey, guys. Hey, um... You know how you like doing uh, prank phone calls with your kids? Uh, sometimes I do. What about it? Well, like, you remember how you used to fuck with Connie and say, like, he had all these kids yes. that you wouldn't take care of? You ever think of, call like, having one of your kids call Connie and be like, Daddy, Daddy. I, I don't... <laughs> that would be funny, <laughs> but I, I don't know if that concept, if they would understand it yet. Okay. You know? I don't know. It was just a thought. It, it, it was so fucking funny because he gets all fired up. You must be from Philadelphia. I am from Philadelphia. Yeah, okay. Because when, when, when somebody calls about a 15-year-old bit, pretty, <laughs> it's pretty much easy to figure out where you're from. Well, the thing is, like, I still keep up with the show. I mean, I have my new favorite, uh, Adrian Mark Montgomery. Oh, fuck. He's awesome. Yeah, I just wish he was... Uh, because he'll disappear and come back and disappear and come back. He uh he has some weird triggers. Like he flipped the fuck out on Jeff the other night. I, I know. I, it, right, right when he mentioned the cops, he freaked yeah. out. <laughs> <laughs> he did. He started fucking cursing. Call the fucking cops. Yeah. Right. Like when you mention the cops, he freaks out. So maybe, <laughs> maybe from now on, I'll just like, maybe when we're on talking to him, somebody can call in and just start saying how they're the police. And they're coming over to get him and shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's. I didn't I, realize he was that old. Yeah, he, how, he said he was. Uh, he was sixteen in the eighties. Oh uh, yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't know how old he is. He came in one time, but the thing is, though, is I want these guys to come into the studio because that's fun. Like, yeah. con like Country Jeff and and all these others, and I don't, I don't mind getting a car for them to go get them. The problem is is they won't fucking leave. <laughs> you know, and I, I don't, there's no staff anymore and stuff, and a lot of people are working from home, so it's like we don't have yeah. anybody, there's nobody there to, to tell them, okay, it's time to get out. You know what I mean? Yeah, that sucks. Yep, so maybe uh, maybe someday I could, or maybe if there's a, uh, like an off-duty police officer or something that, can, that listens to the show can come in and I can say, look, on this day we're going to have so-and-so come in. Uh, you know, country Jeff, can you help us, you know, get him the fuck out when uh, the segment's <laughs> over? <laughs> uh, yeah, crazy wrangler. Yeah, that's what I need, a crazy wrangler. You're right. Uh, like, well, not, not even crazy, yeah. just just more of a, uh, a fucking, like, I don't know. It doesn't get it, wrangler. I don't, you know what I mean? Just like, it's over, time <laughs> to go. Because, you know, others will behave like... Uh, 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 Beth and Barry, they'll behave. Yeah. You know? Have they and, been in? Yeah, yeah, they've been in. Uh, uh, Barry, uh, Beth's flashed me her boobies. 
<laughs> oh man, I, I don't know what she looks like. Like, what was that? Like, she uh. Let's just say she looks like the way she would, just by the way she sounds. <laughs> All right, yeah, no, because I had a picture in my head, and I don't know, it doesn't sound, doesn't seem pleasant. No. Well, you know, I, I should bring them in. You should or you shouldn't? I should, because they're due to come in. I think they're fun when they come in. And then, you know, the whole idea, when people like that come in, it's just like Johnny Five at the end of the show. At 10 o'clock, then we'll put them on here, you know, on the Facebook Live and stuff, and then they can take phone calls and do their own show. That's fun. That is fun. Yeah. Um, you were trying to fuck with Johnny Five that one time, but, like, like you would do with Freddie, but, like, Johnny Five wasn't buying it, though. No. Well, plus, I'm in the studio. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm right there, so... You know, people people will call in and stuff, and he'll just look at me and do the cutoff sign and all that. And it's, you know, I don't know. But if the beauty is, is if, if it sucks, it just goes away. It doesn't hurt the show because it's on Facebook Live. If it's good, then we can play it on yeah. the radio and talk about it and stuff. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I'd love you to find somebody who's, like, as gullible as, like, Freddie or Constantine yeah. out there. Like... Speaking of like 15 years ago, like those studio sex interviews where you just put Connie in a room with a random guest. Yeah, but that was, I mean, keep in mind, that was in a, a city where, you know, there was a lot of uh, media, big media. So they were coming to town to do a lot of interviews and stuff. We don't get that here uh, since that. Yeah, we don't get that. I see. Yeah, I don't, I don't really know much about that yeah. sort of thing. Um, are you going to have Zach in? Zach Wild? I don't. Yeah, you know, I don't know. It's, it, it, we're in the morning time. It's hard to do that. Okay. Like when, when they come to town to do shows, they usually drive in in the afternoon. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, because he, he was always great on your show. I know, I know. Uh, he'll call, I'm sure, and talk to us, but I don't know about coming in. Uh, maybe we'll set up a, okay. a little meet and greet thing beforehand, but you're in another city, so you're fucked. Yeah. <laughs> I am. <laughs> How'd you, you quit the turtles? Yeah. That game's hard as fuck. I remember it from back in the 90s. Yeah, they're all hard. And I think I know what it is, too. I think there's a little bit of a lag when I just play through the computer. Okay. Like, I gotta have it on a like a TV and then a TV to the computer. You know, stream it, I guess. I don't know. Either way. Okay. Yeah, the, the, with the turtles, I could never get past that, the that, fucking uh, like that, the seaweed that zaps you. I, I don't know about the seaweed thing. That fucking one dude, the bully guy there, the guy that looks like a uh, uh, it looks like a big pig or something. I can never beat that guy. I, I could get past that, but I mean, I think the next thing was like the electric seaweed, and I can never get past <laughs> that. <laughs> Fucking hard as shit. Electric seaweed. Yeah, I don't know. It's like this pink shit, and like you have to swim through it, <laughs> and like if you touch it, you get zapped, and you fucking die. Yeah. It, you know, I don't know what it is, but like when I got this thing, I was all psyched and stuff. I'm like, oh, I'm gonna play this all the time. I don't play it all the time. You know? Yeah, I, I got some weird Chinese Nintendo thing that has all these games on it, and like half of them are like fucked up, like. It, it's like somewhat like the game you grew up with, but not yeah. really. I, I just don't, I don't have the time anymore. Like, I used to come home from school and just get on this thing and play it until the sun went down. Yeah, yeah. You know? That was back then when you had time. Now you have kids and shit. Yeah, I have kids and shit. And like now, the only time, I'm, the only reason why I'm on now is because everybody's out of town and I'm burning, trying to stay awake so I can watch this UFC thing tonight. So I'm like, fuck. I'll just come on here for a bit and do this until time. We got like what, fifteen more minutes? Yeah, something like that. Did you uh did you get to hang out with Joey Belladonna? No. Ah, bummer. No. Uh I didn't go to Syracuse. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> I uh I don't I don't mean to talk shit on the guy, but I saw them um in Philly, like Recently, when he came back, he's he's bald on top. Oh, I don't know. I don't look at his head. It's really weird. 
like you can't, like you can't, you, you can't tell because like you know it looks the same, but like if I was at the fact the electric factory, so you could see like on top of them. Yeah. If you're close enough, and he's like bald on top, while you're at scalp. Did that did that ruin your experience? <laughs> <laughs> did you go home? <laughs> No, you, no, you, you had enough. Awesome. You had enough. You're like, forget it. I was like, fuck this bald fuck. <laughs> you were mad. <laughs> so I don't know. I mean, like, I'm uh, I'm 39, so I think about going bald a lot. Um, yeah. So what? So, what? I mean, what? You ups- still have what, all your hair. Yeah, I know. What upsets you more? Uh, the electric seaweed or that Joey Belladonna had a bald spot? <laughs> Well, I never threw anything because of Joey Belladonna's bald spot. Okay. No so batteries. Definitely. The, no. Definitely uh, <laughs> the, the electric seaweed. Okay. I don't have to deal with the electric seaweed. I don't get that fucking far because I'm a loser. <laughs> are you going gonna to fly? Are you going to try the flying thing? No. No? You go no. To the, don't you go to like the secret world? I, I, right, but then when, once I go into the secret world, I'll just fucking fall into something and die. So it doesn't matter. I just want to get to mm. like one level. <laughs> oh. That's all I ask. <laughs> That's all I ask in life. You've gotten through this one before, haven't you? Y- yeah. But it's very rare. Mm. This is the old school shit. I would love to see or to hear from somebody who's like in their 20s. they are be like, what the fuck are you playing? <laughs> no, I grew up with this shit, man. Yeah. Uh, beat this game quite a bit. Yeah, you this know. This uh, easier one. Yeah, this is a, it's, it's Super Mario Brothers is awesome. Yeah. No, it was. The second one was real fucking weird, though. I know. I don't fuck with the other ones. Oh. I like the first and third, bro. Yeah. I just saw you die. Yeah, the third one. Yeah. The third one's good. Uh, that's the only one I'll really play. My daughter uh, likes to play it, my youngest, which is weird. You know, what's funny is the graphics on these look like that Roblox, or not Roblox, uh, Minecraft shit that they play. So I guess they could kind of relate to that. Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. I uh, I, I recently, uh, <laughs> I drove up uh, to New York City um, to meet up with a chick from uh, Columbia. Um like two years ago now. She's hot as fuck, dude. Um, I hung out with her once in Philly and, and she wanted to meet me in Brooklyn and party and shit. So I went up there, I got a hotel room and I checked in and she said she was too tired. <laughs> <laughs> you drove all the way and, yeah. and you got a hotel room. She knew she knew that, right? Yes. Yeah. And then she said and then she no. she tried telling me yeah, she tried to tell me, oh, I thought you would come up tomorrow. I was like, no, like I told you. Oh. Uh, so, yeah. Dude, that hurts. So that was the well, last I, time I talked to her. It, the, it does. I, I bought a PlayStation 4 and gave up on women. After yeah, that. yeah, I don't blame it. You know, it's funny. I don't know if I ever told the story. There was a the girl uh, in Wichita named Crystal. and No, Krista. And she was... Hold on a minute. <laughs> she was uh, banging hot. And... In uh, Sacramento, we had her on the radio, and I was like, man, I'd like to bring you into town. We could hook up, have some fun. She's like, yeah, yeah, that'd be fun. <laughs> so I bought a ticket to fly her into town, right? Yeah. And uh, I get a call that afternoon, or right before I go on the radio, and her sister calls and goes, uh, yeah, she was in a car accident. She's not coming. <laughs> I go, what? I spent like 400 bucks for a round ticket for this girl, and then she never talked to me again. Well, if you if you weren't interested in coming out, why would you have me spend that kind of dough? Exactly. Like, I, I mean, it, if they don't want to hang out with you, just fucking say it. But yeah. like, don't let it get to the point where we're wasting our time and our fucking money. Right. I, uh, yeah, I spent that night um, alone in a hotel room in Brooklyn eating McDonald's and watching The Simpsons. <laughs> did you talk did, about a low point in life? Did you curse out loud? Did you go like fuck? 
I, I don't remember, but I did I did text her something angry. Yeah, I was good. like, you wasted my time and money, and you know, yeah, she tried to, I don't know, she texted me like a few days later, hey, I'm at, I'm at uh, Sesame Place, which is in uh, Pennsylvania somewhere. I was like, oh, cool. Yeah, go, <laughs> yeah, go fuck yourself. Uh, yeah, go fuck yourself. <laughs> uh, what, what a bitch. I mean, what does she get out of that? Yeah. I don't know. Like she doesn't get to call she she, she doesn't get to call some loser on a Saturday night play video games and tell that story anywhere. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm the winner here, I guess. Uh, there was one time though where I did have the, the the upper hand on one of these bitches. You know how they were putting their, their cash apps in their Tinder profile? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, what I would do is I would request money from them when they would do that instead of sending the money, right? And uh, most of them would just decline it. Um, but one chick, she put in her profile, send me $5 to prove that men aren't, well, scumbags or something like that. So I requested $5. And I wrote as the note, like, to prove that men aren't scumbags. And she sent me 5 bucks, and then sent me a request for 10 bucks, saying... Prove that they're not, and I just ignored it, and I made five dollars that day. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah. Uh, See, yeah, I don't, I don't, bucks. I can't mess with. I don't. I just don't have time to mess with all that and all of it. There's so much of it that I never paid attention to because you know, I, I'm, I'm not involved in that You're world. Married. Yeah. So. Yeah. Or else I would start fucking around with people. But then again, too, I get very upset, and I. I, I remember things, and I would probably be. I would spend all my time trying to get back at people. Uh, yeah, you, with, with like Tinder, and all, I, I'm actually banned from Tinder. I can't use it for life now. Why? Um, <laughs> they don't tell you, dude. They just fucking ban you. So <laughs> I, I narrowed it down to two things. It was either what I wrote in my profile, or was it the fact that. I had a picture of my butt cheeks on on my uh, my profile. Oh, okay. It wasn't like One you know two. that you just told some some girl to go fuck herself or something. No, uh, no, I, I would never get like that. I uh, I wouldn't really curse anyone out. But in my my profile, I guess it could technically be transphobic because this is a fucked up thing about dating now, dude. Like they don't always tell you they have a dick. So. I feel bad for any woman who looks a little bit mannish because nobody's touching that. Like, you just automatically assume that they're trans. So, and there's, there's pregnant bitches on there, too. Um, on Tinder, and now I do Facebook dating, there's pregnant fuckers on there. So in my profile, I write, um, if you, um, like a lot of women, they write lists of demands in their profiles. They, they come off like cunts, like right off the bat. Yeah, so, yeah, right. So... I write my profile. Well, a lot of profiles have lists of demands, so here are my demands. Number one, don't have a penis. Number two, don't be pregnant. And that's it. Right, and somebody could have flagged but, it, and they didn't, you know, and you, did, you don't, like, sit there and try to fight back, right? You don't say, like, hey, review this. This wasn't bad. It, it's really hard to do that. Yeah. Like, I, I looked into it, uh, but because I have, like, an iPhone and shit, they ban you from your... Um, your Apple account. Oh, wow. Um, so unless I, yeah, so unless I switch to like Android, I can never use Tinder again. Oh, that's crazy. I thought they would do it through like a, an email or something. You just put another email in there. No, I, I went to log in one day and I had even purchased like the gold account where you get like <laughs> infinite likes and shit. And I went to log in and it was like, oh, you've been banned for life. And, and, and they get to keep all that, 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 that dough, right? Yeah, yeah, they keep the money. Yeah, they put that in the uh, in the shit when it, that you you click accept without reading. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah, well, who's gonna read all that? Shit? No, like, nobody, nobody <laughs> does. Nobody does until no. they get fucked over like you. Then they go, ah, shit. <laughs> <laughs> all right, dude, I'm gonna bounce off here because I gotta get ready to watch this UFC shit. All right, very cool. Good talking yeah. to you. I hope yeah. you uh, hope you enjoy your night. All right, you too, man. Good talk. All right, later, Chris. See ya. Was good. Guess I'll do one more call before I bounce out of here. Yep.
I came on playing games and stuff because I knew there'd be like some lulls as far as the uh, phone calls and all that because it's not the normal. Um, it's not the normal seven o'clock on Thursday night show. Hey. What the hell is this shit? Is this you, Joyce? Yeah. Why are you always bitching? Why do you watch that? Because I'm all anxious, Dad. It's something actually funny for you to do. You want to have sex? No, this is better. This is better? Yeah. Where's your man at? Sitting here. Yeah. I can't believe he's still with you, or you haven't beat him up and kicked him out yet. No, I'm getting there. You need to call my buddy Goat. I actually know a dude that goes by the name Goat. You need to call him. I'm not calling anybody. What that's, the fuck? Why not? Because that's work. I'm just kind of sitting here and... Uh, just doing this shit, and then I'm gonna. You have a skin tag on dick for Blake. What the fuck? So I gotta talk about pussy to get you to do something? Yes. Okay, well, I hear goat pussy just like human pussy. Yeah, yeah, let's hear it. <laughs> oh. I don't know what she said. She hung up. I think she called me a pussy or something. I bounce here. Uh. Oh, that's weird. There's nothing there. All right, whatever. All right, I'm going to bounce. UFC starting here in a second. I want to check that out because that dude, uh, that Conor McGregor guy's battling tonight. The rubber match, I think. Is that what they call it? The rubber match? It's like the last one. Where... All right, I'm going to bounce out. Thanks for uh, checking the shit.